Stress drunk. Hey everyone, welcome back to Robotrek, or more specifically, Snest Drunk Plays Robotrek. I've backtracked over to Rococo after plowing through the forest there. Um, there's something here that I want to show you. I actually did some grinding and uh, made it to level 2. So what I'm going to do here is read the level 2 book that's back here. And I, I actually already did that off camera, but it'll say, it'll make that sound and you've picked up the skill to create a sword one. And what you can do after you obtain that skill is if you go to an R&D room, uh, you can make these swords. They're 200 gold pieces a piece. And this is gonna be kind of time consuming here, but I'm gonna make three of them and then I can show you what you can do with them after that. I was pretty, uh, pretty drunk the last episode, I'm not going to lie. Sorry about that. Un totally unprofessional. <laughs> but um, no, it's, I was, uh, I'm pretty hungover today, so uh, let's get this show on the road. I, I was kind of flying through stuff. Let's uh, now, let's see, where do I combine these? Okay, he's, my sword is still at level one, so I've got essentially have four level one swords. So let's see here. Yeah, here we go. Combine two items, and then you hit the R button to get from your items to your uh, your robot's items. And you rolls them in. Machine does its work, and now you have a level two sword, which obviously means you can do more damage. Uh, you can do this up to level three, I think. But after that, I believe I'm not sure. I'm not an, I'm not an expert when it comes to this game. To believe me, there's a lot I don't know. <laughs> but the uh, I think you need a level 2 sword to go beyond that. You need to combine two level 2 swords to get a up to uh, a level 4 sword, I believe. I'm not sure. Because it'd be pretty cheap if you could just keep making swords. Or maybe you can. You can go all the way up to level 9. I think that's where you max out is level 9. Anyway, let's uh, keep going here. To the river... It's a pretty shallow river, actually. Let's get this guy, and I'm going to show off this battle real quick. I'm going to be skipping a lot of battles, though, but there's something I forgot to show off. When you go to attack, and you want to hit run like that to get to your attacks. I don't know why I didn't do that last time, but that's how you obtain your attacks, and that's what Crash does. It completely not. It's, it, those attacks are really good for boss fights, but for quick battles... Like this asshole bird here, I'll show this off real quick. You can just do you can just press X for a bomb right away. Like Or you can select it manually, but you, you can just press X and I missed somehow. These birds are a bastard. Now I gotta sit here and take this <laughs> Sit here and take these attacks. Alright. Let's try... Oh, God, that was a screw-up. All right. Now I can attack him at close range. And let's do murder. Or no, let's do crash, because I, I want to make sure this thing dies. Okay, got that guy out of the way, and I got an extra cure. Let's go up here and see what's in here cleared out that area, so let's uh, 200 gold pieces. Okay, I'll take it. Let's go across the... Or let's read the sign here first. Here's a new enemy here. These gel things. Oh, and we've got a nice line of Pokeballs up there. Let's get those first. Hey, I got my energy replenished. That's nice. A nice bonus there. And what's in this next one? Hey, equipment level up. That's cool. Oh, didn't get the other one in time, but I can still fuck that guy up. Oh boy. Yeah, these uh now I have to sit here. That's a that's the problem. Yeah, that's really this guy's only attack. Unless you're up close, I think it the gel forms into like a fist and punches you. <laughs> Which is pretty amusing. But uh yeah, let's just go up here, hit the R button. Take advantage of my leveled up sword. Yeah, that's those gel things there. 
Okay, thanks. Those gel things there are as close as you get to uh, random battles, because they tend to pop up out of nowhere. Most other... Uh, most other uh, th uh, enemies will be on screen. Like, I I'm sure I'll run into a gel down here somewhere. Or maybe not. Let's cross the water here and find out what's in this thing. Smoke, I think, is no different than any other smoke in any other uh, RPG. You use it to uh, get away from battles, like if you can't run. Alright, cleared those two out. Let's open this up. 200 gold pieces, cool. But yeah, smoke is when you can't... Uh, you can't run from a battle. You, you obviously, whoops, I did not mean to do that. You want to, uh, yeah, use that for when you can't run from a battle, in other words. Okay, let's go to the cave mouth, and first let's clear out the enemies in this brief little area. Okay, that's everybody. Holy crap, $7,500. Jeez, that's the most I've ever come across. Anyway, um, wow, I am loaded with gold now. I, you'll see there I have only three hit points. That's because I faced three of those fucking things. Um, also, I forgot to mention you can equip an item on your character, in my case, Drunk, and have him interfere in a... Uh, or not interfere, but have him interrupt a battle to use an item to roll it out to your robot. So that's a nice feature. But yeah, I need to use a cure to replenish this dude's health. And, uh, yeah, that's all that stuff. What's the sign say here? Yeah, I'm sure it is. It's a cave. It's not a... Not Disney World. Uh-oh. What's going on here? Hmm, good for him. Okay. <laughs> that's good. <laughs> Lots of bombs. Hmm. Uh-oh. Got kind of a cutscene here. Somehow that doesn't seem like a good idea. All right, let's take a step back here. I'm sure it will. Mm, looks like it worked. Uh-oh. Or not. Whoopsie doodle. <laughs> Inventions are always fail. What? Wow, what a brat. <laughs> he takes the time to glare at everyone individually before leaving. And then he shoves me aside. What a baby. Well, that didn't work. So now what are we going to do? How are we going to get these kids out of here? No? Hmm. Well, if you noticed earlier, there is a stairway up here. Let's see what's up here. Oh, it's a big hole in the ground. That That's what collapsed to uh, to fill the wall up after it got blown up. But anyway, I'm going to call that an episode. A little short today. My apologies, but thanks for watching, and have a great rest of your day.